Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back. Uh, whew, today was a busy day. Um, literally just moving a lot of stuff back and forth. Um, and this is this day two of moving. We're moving um, all, all the big stuff yesterday, and today was a lot more of the smaller stuff and cleaning the apartment. Um, and so I pretty much spent all day, if not at the old apartment here, like helping um, Kim set up the room and you know um, installing certain things. And uh, fixing up my mic, which is pretty awesome. This is dope. Uh, it's like with a uh, its own mount now. It's a shock mount as well as like its own uh, microphone stand. Anyways, I'm actually really hungry. So I'm going to go straight to it. Um, we got a little bit of Taco Bell from earlier, um, which is should be a bunch of different types of tacos. I At this point, I heck, I don't remember what kind. I know one of them is like a Dorito taco. Um, one of them is like a Chalupa, I believe. Oh, yeah, definitely a chalupa. And um, I know for sure, though, once I'm done with all this, I'll link it in the bottom in the description of what tacos they were. Um, but yeah, you know what? Let me take all this out right now. Oh, sweet. I also got a little bit of dessert, too. Forgot what this... Those little cinna... The cinna balls or whatever? Um, okay. Let's see. And I believe these were, oh no, these were all soft tacos for the most part. I usually prefer, prefer soft tacos over crunchy. Um, I mean, it doesn't really matter. Mm. I think this one's the steak one and just a regular steak taco. Okay, I realized. I pretty much swallowed this one way too fast. I didn't get to show you the taco or a bite. Sorry about that. Literally, this is my first meal of the day, and it's already like 8.47. Right here. Here you go. Here's a little taste of the rest of it. Let's see if you can see that. Yummy. Oh, and a lot of the extra meat. Okay, what we got here next is, okay, it's a Cool Ranch Dorito taco. Since this was, this, this was purchased like five hours ago and just reheated, it looks a little, it actually looks exactly like the Doritos, that Cool Ranch Doritos straight from the bag, which is pretty dope. Let me take this out so you can see it. It's a little softer now, but this is basically it here. Oh man, and it got all messy and everything like that too. I now know if I purchase crunchy tacos, pretty much gotta eat them immediately. This one actually tasted a lot better than normal though. Oh gosh, I'm a mess. <clears throat>
Here you go. Last bite real quick here. Hmm. hmm. What else do I got here? I think this is the Gordita. Oh, yeah. This is the, um, not Gordita. What is it called? It's like the double decker, I think. So it has one soft taco and it's supposed to be one crunchy taco in the middle. I think this one just has beef filling. Here you go, let me. Oh, yeah. It's mainly just beef filling there. As you can see. Okay. And I swear the moving pro process in itself has been pretty crazy just because I never realized how much Kim kept so much of her clothes until me and all my friends started moving them. It was, it was actually pretty funny, but damn. So right now we're just going through the process of what to keep and what to toss, which takes hell long. <clears throat> And now know what happens when you eat Taco Bell like five hours after you order it fresh. <laughs> Honestly, I missed the crunch that it should have. That was cool. I don't eat anything at this point. I'm gonna actually skip this one for later. Because I know that one's gonna fill me up pretty fast. I'm gonna see what else I got. Oh, nice. This one looks like it was a crunchy taco. Kind of like split in the bottom here. So I'm gonna have to hold it a little weird. But this one's mainly just a chicken taco. You can see. Let me see if I can get you a little bit of the pieces here. Which looks mainly like this. Hmm. I should say these small tacos, I could probably eat like eight or ten of these just alone. So compact. It's so good. Mm. Done with that one. Oh, 
Oh, and then my last one. I don't even know what the heck this is. Oh, I guess this is another... I think this is the Gordita itself. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, no, cancel that. This is the Double Decker Taco. I think this is the Gordita. Cool, let me actually put this one. Because we only have like a little bit of sauce this time. Get some of the Diablo sauce on this bad boy. Nice. It's pretty good. I'm just noting this thing. This one's supposed to be a beef one, but they put like a lot of extra beans on this. And it's still not bad, but really beany. Oh, there it is. A little bit of water would kind of help. All right, back to the Gordita Crunch here real quick. I wish I had like a small like Crunchwrap Supreme or something like that now. But uh, it's okay. Oh, that's true though. I do have dessert though. Mm -hmm. Put this over. Mm, look at that bite with the sauce though.
There's a good amount of sauce on there. Mm. Cheers. Mm. Let me actually show you the last thing I got here. There's a little like cinnamon balls. And I think if I'm correct about it, it's supposed to be something inside. I don't remember, but it's supposed to be something. Let's see. Mm. Oh yeah, okay. So apparently there was cream inside there, but it kind of got mushed in over time since it's been kind of sitting there for a little bit. So it's all mainly just mushed into the dough. It's mm, super sweet. Oh, a little too sweet for my liking. So yeah, guys. My advice. If you purchase Taco Bell, eat it as soon as you get it. Don't be like me and wait like five, six, seven hours to eat it because anything that you got that's crunchy basically just turns into a soft taco that's mushy. I mean, it was still tasty and all, but <clears throat> not what it could have been, you know what I mean? So, anyways, if you liked what you saw, definitely hit on that subscribe button um, or feel free to drop a comment on there, which would be awesome too. And, you know, thanks for watching.